Okay, and we're back. So today we're gonna to talk about confidence. Now, let me first explain to you why confidence is so important. And after that, I'm gonna give you some actionable steps to increase your confidence based on my own experiences. By the way, if I sound a little bit ill, it's because I am ill, got a little bit of a cold. But anyway, why is, conf why is confidence so important as a man? First of all, it goes without saying, but it helps you attract girls. Now, it is the most important trait for attracting girls out of anything else. If you wanna have an increased level of success in this area, you, this is the most important um, trait you need to work on, your confidence. Also, it helps you gain respect from other men. And this is pretty, you'll start to notice this once you start developing your confidence and, and building your confidence up. So if you're like really low level confidence right now, you might not get as much respect from other guys, but as you build it up, I've started to notice anyway in my personal life, and I'm sure some of you can relate, you just get so much more respect. And it's like, I'm not sure how to describe it really, but you can just like sense it, you know, you can you can sense guys being more friendly to you. You make friends easier, that's a big one. So those are the two reasons why you need confidence as a man. And to be honest, if you haven't got confidence as a man, it's unacceptable, to be honest. Your life will be drastically worse than if you do. So this is a really important video. Now I'm gonna give you some free actionable steps that you can take that will increase your confidence based on my own experience. So I used to be, for, you, for those of you who don't know, which is everyone, <laughs> I used to be like really, really shy, nervous. It was only a couple of years ago where I was literally a completely different person. Really unconfident, wouldn't talk, couldn't talk to anyone. Making friends was difficult, had no, no real friends, no real social connections or social skills. And the first way I, I learned to build this confidence up was I started watching people who portrayed this like masculine, confident personality. A couple of guys I'm gonna recommend to you. First of all, Andrew Tate. He's trending right now on TikTok. Um, start watching his videos. And I know, have you heard of the quote? I'm sure you've heard of the quote. You are the five people you surround yourself with. Well, that is very true and it goes it goes with what you watch as well it also applies with when you're watching youtube for example who you watch matters so watch confident confident people like andrew tate second of all surround yourself with confident people i'm not friends with anyone who's not confident simple as that let's the the, the way i put it is like the analogy i use is like this you've probably heard this before as well imagine you have a moldy bit of fruit a moldy apple in a in a bottle, right? And then you put other apples in there. You're like a fresh apple. You haven't been tainted by this moldy apple. You put it in there and then you leave those two apples for like a month. That mold from the moldy apple is gonna spread to the fresh one, which is you. And over time, if you surround yourself and spend time with people who are losers, who are unconfident, and who don't have the traits that you want, you will become like them. So it is imperative that you surround yourself with confident people. Now, the second step that helped me improve my confidence massively, this is probably, I would say this is the most important thing, is get in shape. And I know you've heard this all before, it's like it's a classic, classic thing, you know. You've heard this so many times, but it is literally vital. The f it will 100% without, like guaranteed, 0% chance of failure, it will increase your confidence massively. Just just seeing that first noticeable change, you don't even have to like become an elite level. Just seeing that first noticeable change in your physique in the mirror, confidence boosts instantly and it stays with you as well. Because think about it, your body is actually, you are inside your body for the rest of your life. Like, there's no escaping your body. Like you have to treat your body as if it's the only one you've got, which it is the only one you've got. And so you've got to treat it with, with respect and you will massively gain confidence from that. You'll start walking around with your head up, your chest up more. So that is vital. The third and final actionable step is about body language. Body language is also, it's just so important. You've really got to drill this into your mind. So I used to have really bad body language when I was younger. 
And what I started doing was, I started forcing myself to have good body language. I started forcing myself to take up, when, when I, whenever I sat down, I took up more space deliberately. And at first, this is gonna, you're gonna, this is gonna like weird you out. You're gonna be uncomfortable when you first start doing this. But after a while, um, it becomes natural to you. And you just start to do it without thinking. And when you get to that stage, you know that you've improved massively. So whenever you have the opportunity to practice, like whenever you're sitting down, don't, you know, don't curl up like this, head down. You wanna make the space your own. Take control of the space. Also, eye contact, very important. Whenever you're speaking to someone, try not to, um, try to, try to lock eye contact as much as possible. Very big, useful tip there. Start practicing these things. Start getting to know these concepts and start taking action. That is the most important thing. If you take one thing away from this video, it is that you must take action. I could tell you everything you need to know about anything, but if you don't take action, then you will not see results. Trust me, I was in the place where I was, I was so unconfident and I wasn't taking action. And as soon as I stepped out of my comfort zone and I start, started taking action, my confidence dramatically increased. And it's not what the level I want to be at yet, but we're only getting better and better with time. So yeah, start implementing these actual steps and you'll see a real difference.